Pulp with a Shotgun is sure to be a cult classic. It was a fake thriller that had the honor of being presented in front of the Rodriguez Tarantino Double Bill Grindhouse in Canada. And, like Machete, it became a real film. There were several factors that enhanced my enjoyment of this film. First, the location of the screen. It was this rundown shitty theater. This is that shitty theater. Two, full houses are one thing, but a rowdy midnight screening is perfect. And C, there was a great opening act. Before the film, there was a short, The Legend of Beaver Dam, which was something of a gory rock opera between a group of young campers and an urban legend. I give it five campfires out of five. But Hobo with a Shotgun, it's a fun fucking ride. It's the appropriate way to do snakes on a plane. It never takes itself too seriously, and the style is completely owned and executed magnificently. It's bloody, swear-heavy, and completely over the top. Rucker Hauer plays said hobo, who rides into a very corrupt town and sets out to clean up the streets with nothing but a shotgun. Clichés are abound, but in the best way possible. A grizzled hero, a whore with a heart of gold, a showman crime boss, and there are tons of quotable one-liners. And the visuals in Hobo are a standout. Everything is heavily lit with greens, reds, yellows. The gaffer just must have had a party with this one, making this film look like nothing I've ever seen before. Hobo with a shotgun is the perfect midnight screening. I give Hobo with a shotgun five shotguns out of five, because that's like a really simple way to go. <laughs> so those are my thoughts on Hobo with a shotgun. Leave your thoughts in comments below, and feel free to check out any previous Sundance reviews. Me, I'm gonna watch Sundance be taken down. It's the end of an era.